Perseus was a brave hero known for his many adventures. One of his most famous challenges was to find the dreadful Gorgon Medusa and bring back her head as a trophy. The whereabouts of Medusa were unknown, and many brave heroes had gone before Perseus in search of her, only to disappear without a trace. Despite the dangers, Perseus was determined to succeed. He knew that he would need the help of the gods to defeat Medusa, so he sought out the guidance of his half-brothers, Hermes and Athena. Hermes, the messenger of the gods, knew all the routes that led to any destination. He agreed to guide Perseus to the hideout of the nymphs, who possessed the artifacts that Perseus needed to accomplish his mission. Athena, the goddess of wisdom, offered Perseus her shield as protection. This shield was special because it was so polished that it almost resembled a mirror. Perseus could use the reflection of the shield to see Medusa without looking directly at her, which would turn him to stone. Perseus and Hermes arrived at the cave of the Grii, three old ladies who shared one eye between them. Perseus cleverly stole the eye from the Grii, and in exchange for its return, they told him the whereabouts of the guardian nymph and Medusa's hideout. The guardian nymph gave Perseus winged sandals, the helmet of Hades, and a special bag to keep Medusa's head. She also told him that Medusa was once a beautiful priestess who was cursed by Athena for offending her. Now, anyone who looked into Medusa's eyes would turn to stone. Perseus finally reached Medusa's lair, where he was confronted by Medusa's sisters, Euryale and Stheno. Perseus managed to enter Medusa's hideout without being seen, and he found her sleeping among countless statues of men who had been turned to stone by her gaze. Inspired by Athena, Perseus used the reflection of his shield to see Medusa without looking directly at her. He then beheaded Medusa with his sword, and from her blood sprang the winged horse Pegasus and the golden giant Chrysor. Perseus quickly put Medusa's head in the special bag and used his winged sandals to fly away before Medusa's sisters could find him. He returned home a hero, and Medusa's head became a powerful weapon that he used to defeat his enemies.